Hey guys, and welcome back to my corner of the world. And you know what day it is. It is Flipping Friday. So for today, I've got a split tutorial for you guys. So in today's video, we're going to be going over how exactly to do your splits properly. So I teach gymnastics, as you may or may not know. I've been teaching it for about four years. But and in those four years, I've seen a lot of people doing splits or trying to do their splits, but not quite making it. And in the years of doing gymnastics, I've seen a lot of people, you know, thinking that they're in the splits and thinking they got it. So we're going to go over how to do your, spr your splits correctly. So without further ado, let's get started. So you're going to start in this lunge position with your hips facing forward and one foot in front. From here, you're going to put your hands down on the floor and make sure your knee is tucked under. Notice how my foot isn't turned up the side, it is pointing straight back behind me. From here, you're going to make your front knee straight and slowly slide down, trying to keep your hips square. Square means facing forward, not turned out to the side. So you're going to keep your hips facing forward as far as you can and continue to slowly slide down to your split. Now here is a full right leg split. My front knee is straight, my back knee is straight, my hips are as straight as I can get them. My hips are not perfectly square. This is perfectly square for me in a split, but not square. I can go all the way down. Now also, if you notice, my knee is hidden on the floor. It's not bent out to the side, and I'm not holding my leg up off the ground. So knee on the ground, pushing through as far as you can. And this, my friends, is a right leg split. Oh, one more thing to go over. While you're doing your split, you don't really want to be laying down on your leg. I mean, it is a cool trick. It is something you can do, definitely. It looks nice for like a floor routine or some other kind of dance. However, when you're just stretching to, to have splits for the sake of doing the splits, it's not a lay down thing. You want to be reaching back as far as you possibly can. Like so. And then to relieve some of the pressure, you just slide out of your splits and hug your knees. Makes everything feel way better. So yeah, there you have it. That's a right leg split. Easy as that. Now, getting your splits is a little tricky. You may not be able to go down immediately all the way, and that is okay. It took me a while to get my splits too, believe it or not. For instance, I only got my left leg split just a couple years ago, like three years ago. I only got my left leg split all the way down. And obviously, as you saw, there are still ways that I can improve on my split. So just keep that in mind while you're practicing your own. I'll have another tutorial coming out shortly for a middle split as well. Because a middle split is another big one. And it's also kind of important for your gymnastics or cheer or dance or whatever it is you're doing. Or if you just want to do it for the sake of being able to be like, I can do the splits. Go you. Anyway, so I'll have that coming out relatively soon. But until then, I hope you'd enjoyed this video. And remember to like this video if you did. Um, subscribe. Hit the bell notification down below so you can be updated every time I post. Leave a comment in the comment section down below and I'll get back to you. Also, if you like fish or want to see what I've got going on in that tank up there, uh, go check out my other videos that I upload every Wednesday. And you'll get to introduce, uh, get to see the whole crew and the other things I got going on over there. So yeah, pretty cool. You should check it out. So bye for now. So, um, mm. <laughs>